This channel will give you life improving content. Please subscribe to the channel and hit the good button. Burnout. The Silent Epidemic. To tackle burnout. The silent epidemic with causes of burnout and warning signs of burnout as solutions, we have to understand the reasons and symptoms that lead to burnout. In this section, we will explore what causes burnout and the warning signs that indicate you may be experiencing burnout. Causes of Burnout. Workers' Fatigue Factors. Today's corporate world is plagued by employee burnout. Loads of contributing factors exist, such as Excessive workload Work dissatisfaction Lack of autonomy Job ambiguity Inadequate compensation, recognition Constant communication demands And the pressure to maintain a work-life balance. Technological advances like telecommuting make workers more susceptible to stress and depression. Organizations strive for high productivity, but don't manage fatigue levels, unknowingly facilitating a silent epidemic. Burnout is not only caused by external stressors. It can also result from individual traits, like perfectionism or a pessimistic outlook. Harvard Business Review conducted a study revealing a 33% drop in performance for burnt-out employees, leading to turnover and hurting bottom lines. Conclusion. Jump off the hamster wheel before you crash and burn. Warning Signs of Burnout Burnout is on the rise in today's workforce, so it's essential to be aware of the signs that could indicate an impending burnout episode. Here are some semantic NLP adaptations of warning signs of burnout. Physical exhaustion and fatigue. Loss of motivation and focus. Cynicism or disinterest in work increases. Overall productivity declines. Insomnia or changes in sleep patterns. Weakened immunity, leading to more illnesses. Everyone's experience with burnout is unique and the symptoms may vary from person to person. To avoid a burnout taking over, it's essential to take action when the warning signs start to appear. Burnout doesn't discriminate, it can affect anyone regardless of their career path, work style, or workplace environment. A study published in the Journal of Occupational Health Psychology further highlights this point, showing that burnout is linked to age, education level, working hours per week, job demands and autonomy among healthcare workers who treated COVID-19 patients during the pandemic. Stress is like a credit card, you can keep using it, but eventually, you'll have to pay for the debt, plus interest. Understanding Stress To understand stress and its impact on your life, delve into the types of stress and effects of stress. Knowing these subsections will help you identify patterns of stress in your life and understand how it may be impacting your health and well-being. Identifying these patterns can help you develop effective strategies to manage and reduce stress. Types of stress. Stress, there's no diet like it. It can take away your hair, sleep, and your sanity. But what types of stress are there? Here are some semantic NLP variations of the heading types of stress. Different forms of stress. Varieties of stress. Categories of stress. The different types of stress include. Acute stress. A short-lived stress that arises from an adverse circumstance. Chronic stress. Long-standing stress with no end in sight, often caused by environment or psychological factors. Episodic acute stress. Repeated episodes of acute stress leading to exhaustion. Trauma-induced stress. Triggered by experiencing or seeing a traumatic event. Workplace stress. When work-related situations are too much, like too much workload, deadlines, or conflicts with colleagues. It's important to remember that many things affect how people experience different kinds of stress, from resilience to coping strategies. If you want to effectively manage everyday stresses, try mindfulness techniques like deep breathing, meditation, or yoga. You can also prioritize tasks and delegate responsibilities if you're feeling overwhelmed. Having supportive relationships and a healthy lifestyle can help you better handle difficult situations. Knowing the various types of stress can help individuals identify their own type and use effective strategies to reduce it. Effects of stress. Stress can wreak havoc on the mind and body. Heart rate rises, cortisol levels go up, and your immune system is weakened. Mental health issues like anxiety and depression can result. Physical symptoms like headaches, chest pain, and digestive problems may also occur. Everyone is impacted by stress differently, so it's important to find what works for you in terms of healthy coping mechanisms. Exercise and meditation are two popular methods. Research suggests that chronic stress may increase the risk of Alzheimer's disease. It's also a major risk factor for heart disease. More research is underway to understand long-term effects. During World War II, 
Psychologists noticed that soldiers who had been in intense combat suffered from anxiety or panic attacks when exposed to mild stress upon returning home. This inspired further research into PTSD and helped doctors create treatments tailored to each individual's needs. Ready to take control of your stress? It'll take some effort, but it's worth it. Roadmap to a Stress-Free Life To create a stress-free life and overcome burnout, evaluate your current situation, identify and eliminate stressors, develop self-care habits, practice mindfulness and relaxation techniques, and build a support system. In this section, we will guide you through a roadmap to achieve a stress-free life by exploring these subsections as solutions. Evaluate your current situation. Assessing your life is the first step on the road to a stress-free life. Take stock of what's going well and what isn't. Look at work, finances, relationships, health, and hobbies. Pinpoint which areas are causing stress and prioritize them. Time to make a plan. Create realistic strategies that match your goals. Maybe cut back on commitments or set boundaries with those who drain your energy. Don't be afraid to ask for help. This isn't a one-time thing, it's an ongoing process of reflection and adjustment. Regularly reassessing helps avoid burnout or returning to stress-causing habits. A common mistake is wanting to make too many changes too quickly, causing burnout or despair. Start with small goals and improve gradually. Understand progress takes time. Trust the process. In short, evaluating your situation is key to managing stress now and in the future. Take small steps to become aware of what works for you. Sustainable well-being is the goal, not quick fixes. Identify and eliminate stressors. For a stress-free life, it's important to spot and get rid of anxiety-causing factors. Below is a three-step guide to identify, eliminate stressors. Create a list of worries, big or small. Check the list and note items that you can modify or remove. Formulate a plan and take charge by solving issues using practical ideas. For this strategy to be successful, taking care of yourself matters. Quality sleep, exercising and mindfulness are some useful tools. They can help to face any possible hindrances in achieving a stress-free life. When forming a plan to tackle identified stressors, prioritize the most urgent ones and set achievable timelines. Breaking down large tasks into smaller ones makes them less daunting. I had work-related stress for months until I asked for help from my colleagues and started delegating tasks. Once I addressed the issue, I was more in control at work and had time for other life aspects. Remember, if you don't take care of yourself, who will? And let's be honest, your cat is too idle to do it for you. Develop self-care habits. Looking after yourself holistically is fundamental for a stress-free life. Cultivating self-care habits can bring balance between body, mind and spirit. Pay attention to thoughts and feelings without judging them. This can reduce stress and increase awareness. Good sleep, exercise and nutritious food can improve overall health and immunity. Relaxation activities such as reading, meditating or spending time with loved ones can distress. Knowing what your individual needs are is key before deciding on any regimen. To cultivate self-care, physical activity can lift mood and clear the mind. Gratitude and journaling have also been proven to help those struggling with stress or anxiety. Intentional self-care practices can lead to better health and less stress. And don't forget the power of a deep breath. Practice mindfulness and relaxation techniques. Mindfulness and relaxation are so important to our lives. They bring us inner peace. There are techniques to help us focus, control our emotions and make us feel better. Meditating teaches us to be aware of our thoughts and feelings without judgment. Pranayama breathing helps us control our inhale-exhale process. Muscle relaxation helps us to tense and release our muscles, calming us down. Aromatherapy with essential oils is good for our brain and improves our mental health. When we add peaceful sounds like waterfalls or birds chirping, meditation can be even more powerful. To get the best results, we need to be regular. Mindfulness has a long history. It started in Hinduism around 500 BCE and was later practiced by Buddhists. It spread throughout Asia and was kept alive in Japan by Zen meditation monks. It's important to have a support system, friends we can cry to, when life gets tough. Build a support system. Having a strong foundation is a must for a stress-free life. Connecting with the right people can give you a support system. This system helps in difficult times by providing comfort and advice, sharing joys and sorrows. It's key to bond with like-minded people who share common interests and goals. 
Belonging and being understood can reduce stress levels. This could be with community groups, sports teams, or volunteering organizations. Also, professional help is part of the support system. This includes therapists, counselors, or psychologists who give an unbiased perspective and strategies to face tricky situations. Creating and keeping a robust support system takes energy and time, but it's worth it. The trick is to find the perfect balance of people, family, friends, or pros. Sarah is an example. She was having trouble in personal and professional life, causing high stress. She opened up to her mentor who guided her through tough times. Listening and offering advice, they made a plan which gave her clarity and positive results in life and work. Maintaining a stress-free life. To maintain a stress-free life according to the article, From Burnout to Bliss, your roadmap to a stress-free life, you can implement boundaries and priorities, cultivate positive thinking, continue self-care practices, and seek professional help when needed. These subsections provide solutions for a balanced and healthy lifestyle, ensuring you can continue to thrive without allowing stress to consume you. Implement boundaries and priorities. Create a stress-free life by setting clear expectations with yourself and others. Make a list of priorities and stick to it. Respectfully say, no, if something doesn't align with your values. Delegate tasks and set firm boundaries with people who drain your energy. Foster positive relationships with assertive communication. Breaking patterns or behaviors that get in the way of healthy boundaries is important. Take care of yourself physically and mentally by practicing self-care. Don't let fear stop you from taking control of your life, take action now. Make changes today for a fulfilling, stress-free life tomorrow. Positive thinking won't solve all your problems, but it will annoy enough people to make it worth it. Cultivate positive thinking. Our mind is always creating thoughts. These thoughts shape how we feel. So, it's important to have a good outlook. To do this, nurture optimistic thinking. Surround yourself with positivity and write down three good things that happen each day. This can improve your mental health. When negative thoughts come, don't push them away. Analyze them. Ask yourself if those thoughts are true or if there are other explanations. Train your brain to view problems as opportunities to learn and grow. To change negative thinking patterns, do loving-kindness meditation. Sit comfortably in a quiet place and picture sending love, kindness, and goodwill to other people. This practice can help you have a positive mindset. Remember, the level of stress depends on our perception. Don't attach emotional labels. Instead, observe neutrally like an impartial spectator. Start making constructive thoughts and lead a fulfilling and joyful life. Self-care is essential. Unless you're a robot, then keep doing your program tasks. Continue self-care practices. Practicing self-care is essential for maintaining a relaxed life. Dedicate time for yourself, and do activities that promote growth. Get enough sleep, eat healthy, exercise, and do meditation or yoga to reduce stress. Everyone has different needs, so find what works for you. Schedule times to disconnect from stress. Professional help from therapists or support groups can help manage emotions. Incorporate mindfulness into your routine by doing gratitude journaling or spending time in nature. If you need help, don't be afraid to ask for it. A therapist may be the answer. Seek professional help when needed. Recognizing when to seek assistance is essential for a stress-free lifestyle. Expert guidance can help reduce anxieties and fears, and speed up recovery time, improving overall well-being. Professional help should be sought if an individual's usual coping strategies don't work or interfere with daily tasks. Consulting with medical professionals, therapists, life coaches, or other specialists can provide tailored treatments for a person's needs. Left untreated, chronic stress and anxiety can lead to depression and PTSD. Managing symptoms quickly increases the chances of recovering successfully, preventing long-term trauma. Seeking professional help has supported many during difficult life transitions. These transitions include marriage counseling, coping with grief or trauma, career changes, and chronic illnesses. It is crucial to get support from qualified professionals. Remember, stress-free living is a journey, and sometimes it's necessary to take a detour through humor to get there. Conclusion making the transformation last. To stay successful on the journey from burnout to bliss, it's key to make the change last. Stay focused and committed. Being consistent and practicing self-care is vital. Take care of mental and physical health too. Set achievable goals, be mindful, 
surround yourself with positivity, and learn to manage stress. Transformation takes time, so be patient and recognize the small wins. Have a support system or write a journal to build accountability. Old habits may seem comforting, but don't let them lead you astray. During stressful times, be extra intentional about self-care. Be gentle with yourself and know that each step towards bliss is worth it. Thanks for watching. Please, subscribe to our channel and press the good button.